know each other, ma'am? No. Well, how do you do? My name's Jack Slate. My name is entertaining guests just now, and I can hardly no, think No, I have to talk to you. <laughs> Hello, Miss Frank. I can imagine how difficult all this must be for you, Miss Frank. Thank you. And I surely do wish it lay within my power to help relieve some of your anguish, it but does. I... I beg your pardon. It does lie within your power. You're the person of the My goodness, would you listen to that? Surely you don't plan on letting a perfectly good one step go by the wayside. I did not come here to dance, sir. I know, but the music is so wonderful and no. No more dancing. You have got to reopen the case. I'm sorry. You'll have to excuse me now. I, I, the what? Helen? How are those plans for the new hospital week come? Real good, thanks to you. And everybody in front of us. I'm mighty glad to hear that. You're a smart man. You were trained as a lawyer. Miss Frank, please. You see, Val Faust has always been like a second Don't you have today. at least the smallest question about the way my husband's trial was conducted? Your husband, ma'am, was tried and found guilty by a jury of his peers. Now, ma'am, that is good enough for me. Then you are either a fool or a coward. such a jiffy. ma'am. What? No, ma'am. You 
know I can't do that. Well, all right. Yes, ma'am. Yes, I surely will. Hey, Leo. What is it? What's the matter? Message from your wife. Oh, God. What's happened? She told me to tell you that you know who is going to re-examine you know what. Say that again. You know who is going to re-examine you know what. Oh, my Lord. Oh, my Lord. Thank you. Thank you. You know who you know who is. Can't say I do. Then you don't know what you know what is. No. Oh, my sweet Lucille, how did you ever manage it? You don't know what any of this means. It means cancel all your part. Forget your big parade. Set it down. It means a crowd will not be cheering, so despite what you've been hearing, you can lay down your spade. Leo, hush up! My mother can stop crying. My rabbi's eulogy can wait. It means that Dorsey can stop dreaming, and my cousin can stop dreaming of his portion of my estate. It's past midnight! It means no, this isn't over. No, the date's not set. No, I won't. Just a curtain. Go see for yourself. Is that right, Iola? I reckon. 
tried to get you to come to his office. Now, who did that happen to? Well, Hattie Hoover said that Corinthia Wilson told her that... He you... asked this Corinthia Wilson to his office. Yes, sir. Then why didn't she testify? She wouldn't. Why not? She said it didn't happen. Mr. Dorsey said it didn't matter anyway, as long as we all... As long as you what? Told the same thing. The truth. But you just said the truth was that Mr. Frank never asked you to come to his office. Mr. Dorsey coached you on what to say. You need any more from these young ladies, Miss Frank? I don't think so. I don't think so either. Thank you. 